Same consistency all the way through. So you see that white up there, that it's not because it's short, it's because it's, it's a gap up there about a half of an inch. You can actually see it better there. It's the same. Here's something that we want to fix. See the little bit of wire in the seam. Very easy to fix. Lift up, add some, some glue and roll it down. We tend not, we do not use a roller. Um, it's not necessary. Uh, but then sometimes it can be stubborn and you do have to come back with a roller. And that would be something like that. Super tight corners. This is type 2 wall covering. That's pretty tight. See that little notch there? Take the knife, trim that off. Sometimes if it's real small and it's wet, we leave it so that when it dries, it can actually be cut without doing damage to the outside corner of the drywall. It's this technique. It's not just being lazy like, oh, somebody just decided to leave that little tiny little thing out. No, just because when it's wet, it's moving. When it's dry, you can cut it easily. Here would go under base, but of course they'll put that on the punch list. 